Okay, the drop off. All right, kids, feel free to explore, but stay close. <gasps> Stromalytic cyanobacteria, gather. An entire ecosystem contained in one infinitesimal speck. There are as many protein pairs contained in this one. Come on, let's, let's go. go. Come on, sing with me. There. Peripera, collaterata, hydrozoa, scatifoa, anthozoa, centifoa, barozoa, three. Oh, hey, guys, wait up. Whoa. Ooh. Saved your life! Oh, you guys made me eat! <laughs> What's that? I know what that is. Oh, oh, Sandy Plank and someone. He called he said it was called a, a butt. Oh, wow, that's a pretty big butt. Oh, look at me! Hello, fantastic folks. Can you believe who's making a grand entrance into our spotlight today? Absolutely right. Our focus is now entirely on a captivating character, and it's no other than the enchanting seahorse. Hold on to your excitement, because our complete attention is now dedicated to the mesmerizing presence of the seahorse, a true wonder of the sea. Now it's time for all of us to come together and declare the name of this truly remarkable being. Say with me, guys. S-E-A-H-O-R-S-E -S -E Seahorse. Well done, guys. Okay, now tell me, what do you all know about these beautiful beings? Absolutely right. Seahorses are indeed captivating creatures known for their distinctive appearance and upright swimming style. But there's so much more to learn about these incredible fish. Let's dive into the world of seahorses and uncover some captivating facts. Who would like to contribute another interesting detail about seahorses? You're spot on. Seahorses have a truly unique reproductive system. The males are equipped with a pouch where they carry and give birth to the seahorse fry. It's a remarkable example of role reversal in the animal kingdom. Can anyone think of another captivating fact about seahorses? Exactly. Seahorses have a prehensile tail, which means they can use it to grasp onto things like seagrass or coral. This helps them stay anchored in their environment, despite their delicate appearance. Where can we find these enchanting creatures? Correct. Seahorses inhabit a wide range of ocean habitats, from warm tropical waters to cooler temperate regions. Their unique adaptations make them well-suited to different underwater environments. What else can you share out, seahorses? Well done. Seahorses are ambush predators and use their long snouts to create a vacuum. Like effect, quickly sucking in small prey like tiny shrimp or zooplankton. This specialized hunting technique sets them apart from other fish. Can someone share another captivating fact about seahorses? You're absolutely right. Seahorses are skilled at changing color to match their environment, providing them with excellent camouflage. This helps them hide from predators and wait for their prey to come by. Okay, tell me one more interesting fact about them. Exactly. Seahorses have a unique swimming style characterized by slow, gentle movements. This contrasts with the rapid, darting movements of many other fish species. It's a charming aspect of their behavior. All right, let's continue our adventure and delve deeper into the world of remarkable animals, discovering the unique ways they lead their extraordinary lives. I'm gonna go touch the butt! <laughs> oh, yeah? Let's see you get closer. Okay. Beat that! Come on, Nemo! How far can you go? Oh, um, my dad says it's not safe. Nemo! No! Dad? Oh, you're about to swim into open water! No, I wasn't it's gonna just a good go thing I was here. Dad, if I hadn't no, shown up, sorry, I don't know. He wasn't gonna go! Yeah, he was too afraid. No, I wasn't. Don't touch it. Don't touch I'm it. I'm gonna touch it. I just wanna look. Hey, how come it didn't sting you? It did. It's just ow, a ow, ow, still. Ow. I live in this anemone, and I'm, I'm, I'm used to these kind of stings. Come here. Ow, ow, ow. It doesn't look bad. You're going to be fine. 
But now we know, don't we? That we don't want to touch these again. Let's be thankful this time it was just a little one. <gasps> ah! Don't move! Hey there, folks. Can you identify the creatures capturing your attention right at this moment? Indeed, you've hit the mark. They are indeed jellyfishes. Okay, now we're going to dive into the mesmerizing world of jellyfish. First, join with me and let's all say that name together. J-E-L-L-Y-F-I-S-H Jellyfish Wonderful work. Okay, who can share some initial thoughts about these intriguing creatures? Absolutely right. Jellyfish are indeed captivating creatures known for their gelatinous appearance and stinging tentacles. Okay, who would like to contribute another interesting detail about jellyfish? Spot on. Jellyfish have a very simple nervous system and lack a centralized brain. Instead, their nerve cells are spread throughout their body. It's a unique adaptation that helps them survive in their underwater world. Can anyone think of another captivating fact about jellyfish? Exactly. Jellyfish have a two-part life cycle. They start as tiny polyps attached to surfaces, and eventually they develop into the familiar medusa stage that we often associate with jellyfish. This dual life cycle is another intriguing aspect of their biology. Okay, guys, where can we find these mesmerizing creatures? Correct. Jellyfish are distributed throughout the world's oceans, and they can be found in various depths, from near the surface to the depths of the open ocean. Different species of jellyfish are adapted to different environments. What else can you tell me out, jellyfish? Well done. Nematocysts are specialized cells found in jellyfish tentacles that contain venomous harpoons. When a jellyfish comes into contact with its prey or a potential threat, these cells fire, injecting venom and helping the jellyfish capture its food or defend itself. Can someone share another captivating fact about jellyfish? You're absolutely right. The size of jellyfish can vary widely. Some are only a few centimeters in diameter, while others, like the lion's mane jellyfish, can have tentacles that stretch for several meters. Now, can you guys tell me one more interesting fact? Exactly. Jellyfish are sensitive to changes in their environment, such as temperature and water quality. Their presence and population levels can provide insights into the overall health of marine ecosystems. Very well. Let's keep exploring and find out more about amazing animals and how they live their special lives. This is bad, Dory. Hey, watch this! Boing, boing, <gasps> Dory. boing, 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 you can't Dory. catch me! Don't boing, bounce on the tops! They will boing. not sting you! Boing. The tops don't sting you! That's it! Two in a row, beat that! Dory! All right, listen to me. I, I have an idea. Uh, uh, a, game. a game. A game. A game. Yes. Ah, I love games. Pick me. All right, here's the game. Oh. Um, whoever can hop the fastest out of these jellyfish wins. Okay. Rules, okay. rules, rules. Okay. You can't touch the tentacles. Uh, only the tops. Something about tentacles. Got it. On your mark, get the... No, 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 wait, wait. Not something about them. It's all about them. Wee! Wait. Dory. Gotta go faster if you want to win. Oh, Dory. Oh. Boing, 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 boing. boing. <laughs> wait a minute. Oh. Dory. Wee. So we're cheating death now. That's what we're doing. We're having fun at the same time. I can do this. Just be careful. Yeah, careful I don't make you cry when I win. No, oh, I don't think so. All right, kids, that's it for now. Let's meet in another video to learn about more animals. Bye-bye, children. Remember to be good, curious learners.